My prince, as an elder of this great kingdom, I need to remind you the rules and regulations as our culture and tradition demands for you to become the next king of this land. You will have to speak one word. I repeat, one word in a year. Just a word. Just a word in every year. <laughs> you are not permitted to speak twice. That is what the tradition demands. <laughs> Let me remind you that if you so deem it fit not to say a word in a year, good for you. That takes you to the next year. Automatically, you have two words to speak in the next year. <laughs> My prince, do you understand? Exactly. I perfectly understand. So I ask you, are you ready? Are you ready for this, my prince? Yes, I am ready. After all, I'm the man of few words. And I'm ready to grab the bull that the home. Uh, my prince, remember, silence is golden. Of that course. is why we want to check you. If you will be able to lead this kingdom of Ogedegbe to the next level. Can I ask you again? Are you ready? <laughs> I'm so much ready for this. Oh. He's ready! He's ready, my Edda! Ime da gole, ebe na wogu gbolo gbo Ime da gole, ebe na wogu gbolo gbo My prince! Nisha for the purification and certification. I am angry. I am angry. My prince, we have been bestowed upon you by the power of the cause, the spirit of silence. He said, you shall remain calm for a whole year. He said, you shall always say one word in every year. He said, <laughs> everything that we divide your attention will be far from you. He said, so we decree in the name of the gods of Ogedebe. He said, <laughs> it is settled, my prince, my son. It is settled. As our culture and tradition demands for you to become the next king of this land, you will have to speak one word. I repeat, one word in a year. Just a word. Just a word in every year. <laughs> you are not permitted to speak twice. But that is what the tradition demands. know in this land of forget the kingdom you have been patient for the past nine years you've remained silent for the past nine years gathering a word in every year in order for you to approach the woman of your dream my prince <laughs> yes she is you cannot tell her your mind <laughs> That's my prince. <clears throat> my darling, I love you. And I want to marry you. Pardon? Excuse me? What did you say? Excuse me. <laughs> Are you said me? What? I can't hear you. What did you say? <laughs> also, Boswa. <laughs> yeah. I can't hear you. Uh, uh, you can speak uh, uh, loud. Uh, my, my prince, my prince, calm down, calm down. Eh? You have been patient all this while. So this time I want to advise you that you also be patient for the, for the next nine years again so that you can marry her. Eh? Just be patient. Patient is a virtue. Ah! 
I love you, eh? Just be my wife. If I want to perish, let me perish. If you perish, I is that my business? I beg perish alone. What? You know you can be prosecuted for that? I want to hear of this. You know you can be prosecuted for that?